My name is Dion Brown, Deputy Head of Schools at KIPP Texas Houston. Today I will be showing you how to access and navigate Google Classroom. Google Classroom will be your child's link to their classroom while they are safely learning from home. Teachers can use Google Classroom to share a wide variety of resources including homework, newsletters, questions, and links to live meetings. Your child should already know their secure login information. Your school should also be sending home information regarding login info. If your child does not know how to log in, reach out to his or her teacher to obtain this private information. Now let's get started. Click on the on the Google Chrome browser icon on your computer screen, or you can open any browser and in the address bar at the top, type www.google.com. Once on the Google Home screen, your child will need to sign in. Once your child has signed in, click on the nine square icon in the upper right to see the list of Google apps. There, your child will find Google Classroom to find assigned classwork, questions, and quizzes, Google Meets for class lectures, Google Calendar to see lecture times and due dates, and Google Docs, Sheets, and Slides to draft and create assignments. Let's start with Google Classroom. The Classroom homepage lists your active classes. It includes a join button on classes you have been invited to join. Click the plus symbol to add a class code if your teacher shares one with you. Let's click on the classroom. Once in a classroom, the stream page for a class will display the current class, upcoming events, updates from your teacher, and classwork and assignments. Now let's check out our classwork. You can navigate to your assignments by switching to classwork at the top of your screen. Here you can see a list of your assignments, view your work, see assignment dates in the Google in the Google Calendar or go to your class Google Drive folder which is created for each of your classes to organize assignments. Now let's click on an assignment. Once in an assignment, you can post a class comment, add your work, mark your work is done once complete, or send a private comment to your teacher. The menu icon in the upper left allows you to navigate your classes, or assignment calendar, and to see a to-do list of all assignments and deadlines. The to-do list page allows you to view upcoming assignments and complete assignments all in one place. If you scroll down on your menu, here you can find your settings. The settings page will allow you to turn on notifications for new assignments or postings in your classrooms. Now that you know how to access and navigate Google Classroom, you are ready to begin learning. Please take some time to, pr to practice moving through the windows so that you can become a Google Classroom expert. Mm -hmm.